All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Crusader Kings 3 Northern Lords Royal Court DLC, Part 85. And we are in the middle of warring with Gur and the Byzantine Empire. Uh, I did see that this is actually pretty nice right here. We've got like four duchies we can take in one fell swoop if we want, if they're still, you know, laid out this way when we get back. Maybe even five. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, so let's go ahead and keep this war going. I'm going to turn down the music just a touch here. There we go. And yeah, we're looking good. We got Tarsos. Capture there? Not worth anything, so we'll ransom. Next location. Let's keep it going. Meanwhile, uh, that one's that war is going to be easy. It's Africa that I'm worried about, being honest. Let's raise more peasants, more levies to go siege things with. 32,000 is plenty to like actually win a battle with, but... Uh, I don't know. Maybe it will end up being enough? I'm not sure. Oh yeah, hit him with that. Light him up while they're split. Absolutely. They got away. <laughs> Our stewardship went down. No! What happened? Refuge in words? Huh. I'm actually not sure what happened there. But that's fine. It lets me get rid of something else I don't want at the moment. Where are some counties I don't want that I have? Are they up here, maybe? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go to here. I don't remember where some of my extra counties are. I definitely, definitely, definitely want Ardara. Not giving that up. Vatican, Guidamaca. That sounds like something I don't need. Here we are, okay. Dafunu, which is part of Ghana. So, Kingdom of Ghana. King Einar. Enjoy King Gooey. There you go. <clears throat> okay, we got a bit of a military here. I didn't do... I didn't do prisoners again. Oh, God. Yeah, we're not just gonna sit here and siege for the most part. I'll split off, like, a thousand levies. That can do that themselves, but I'm gonna go this way. Oh my goodness, 1,500 casualties for moving there? I don't think so. <clears throat> Let's have them go for here. Lost the siege down here, but that's fine. Ransom, nope, not worth a ransom, apparently. So this one's done, we'll keep going. go, 27,000, headed in. They're going in. Pincer attack, hit them from both sides. No escape. Except for running, you know, away from us. I guess that will always work. And for Sapreter has physician. <coughs> Lost another one, okay. Sorry about the coughing again, like always. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a man who has definitely got coughing issues, and I don't smoke or anything like that. I just uh, ever since ever since the damn 19 came through, I've I've been a cougher. There we go. We're gonna lose some men to these moves, but they're here for Valhalla. They'll make it happen. We gonna catch them? Oh, I thought we did. Zero advantage, you say? We'll get them in there. Here comes everything. Oh, 
Wounded the enemy commander, okay. Yeah, we'll win this battle for sure. It'll be, it'll be a gruesome one, though. Lives are going to be lost on both sides. No! Damn, another natural death? Heart failure at 50. Jesus. Those are some young deaths we've been dealing with. Brusa? That's the siege expert? No? Yeah, both of them actually are done. Alright, you can go that way. We'll go that way. Attica's under siege. You guys go ahead. You will not out-siege us, so we can keep doing this all day. You can't go left. There we go. Look at the amount of levies we throw at him. <laughs> Captured Derma, which doesn't help us with the war, really, but, you know, might get some valuable people from it. Ganja. Malika Equin's granddaughter, Aisha. Okay. With suspicion. Actually, I'm going to disband this group. No, they, they're well supplied. They can keep going. I took and healed her out playing with a bow, and to my surprise, she ran into a wounded doe. She later lashed out, lashed out at me, thinking I'd staged the whole encounter as some kind of test. Oh, it's either paranoid or sadistic. That's a real shame. Because obviously I'm going to have to do sadistic between those two. Ambitious and sadistic. Okay. Gun healer's looking a little dangerous. 3,900 to 3,300. Battle at Kuisigu. This 26k is going to go there. 12,000 is going to go here. And this is going to stay here. Let's go, levies! <laughs> Light them up. Capture? That'd be big. Oh. Agni died. Sorry. 270 to 960. Alright, so this is looking better than it did. Let's move them right here so they can respond to any real threat. Like that. There we go. Back to Byzantine. This should be going extremely well. I don't see them stopping us. Nope. Alright, so that's still going great. This is the main one we gotta pay attention to. Yeah, the Kingdom of Gur is huge. This is great. We're going to take so much over. This is really fantastic, actually. How are we doing on innovations? Oh my god, what time is it? I didn't check the time at all before we started this episode. I'm kind of in a rush because I've been really busy lately and I just wanted to get this episode done so I could put it up for tomorrow. Okay, there's my phone. Sorry about that. Okay. It's six o'clock right now, which means we'll probably play another half an hour. I'm, I'm, I, that'll be like a 45 minute. I feel like we've played about 15 minutes so far. That sounds about right. Stop the villain behind that. Windmills in 16 months. Urbanization in 25 years. Rowan was destroyed. No. Oh, no. Yeah, we're just gonna have to take the 300 casualties here, because we need to be re ready to support these people ASAP. There was a pay indulgence that did, like, 157. Created the Cadet Branch Branche Le de Blois. Oh, my goodness. Cadet Branch de Blois. Gotcha. Thought it was Branche de Blois. But no, I'm just stupid. Ravenheart Leche. Another Cadet Branch. <laughs> okay. 67 houses for 2,100 members. Our next legacy is coming up fast. Only 500 more renowned. So like just over a year away. Learn language success. After lots of hard work, I finally learned the Berber language. Yeah, send that message. I'm loving this language hunt we've been on. Um, Mordvinia, do you speak a language I don't know? No, you speak Finnic, that's right. Tahrid. It's a decent little people here. Iranian. Sure. Ah! 
See, this is exactly what I was talking about. Get him in there. Oh my god, they got wiped out way too fast. What the hell? I'm gonna be honest, I didn't expect them to get wiped out that fast, but it was all men at arms, so fair enough. 600 men at arms with a commander versus 1,000 peasants with no commander. I can see why what happened happened. It's just a shame, is all. Ah, uh, that was 10%. I shouldn't have sold that. That's my bad. My bad. Uh, split off. A thousand. Take the rest. Go. Get him. Alright, you guys can go and disband. Countess Natalia was captured. Okay. Colin, we get your first trade here. Queen Othalendis lost against your vassal Queen Svila. Okay, yeah, so Burgundy just lost their war. Good. Okay, Colin has been asking me for a stick horse for a long time. Alright, Colin, a stick horse, huh? And I told him I would get one for him in three months if he displayed more focus in his studies. Ever since I made the promise, he has been redoubling the effort of his studies. I would never deceive you, Colin. He's trusting. Possibly. Come on. There we go. Uh, content or fickle? He's going the diplomacy route. Right. So content would be good for making people like you. Trusting is also good for making people like you, actually. Yeah, I, I think I would never deceive you, Colin. I think trusting is a fine start to his diplomacy route right there. Very good. Russian to Torpetsian, Countess of Yellow, Savita, or whatever you want to call her. Uh, we got people starving over here. That's not good. Oh boy, we've got issues. We've got a lot of issues here. We've been trying to make this work for too long. Holy order. Damn. Eh. This is gonna be a problem. Oh, they're bailing out. Nice. Well organized court got us some opinion. That's good. Five. Nah, he'll get more eventually. Sort of Allah. Six. That's fine. And Bulgaria. Solvi. He'll be at his 50 soon. He's making good money. Prisoners can be ransomed. Pause, pause, pause. Uh, your neighbor, Kanem Hattis. Has won against Murad, the son of Duke, in the Seer Darien conquest of the Chiefdom of Jemba. Okay. And Sardaria keeps keeps growing. It's all over the place, but it is growing. Burgundy is no longer at war, neither are they. I offer you vassalage. Same to you. Ooh, he's he's really willing. Oh my gosh, he's super willing. Why? Damn. Because he's a count, I guess, yeah. Excellent. Welcome to the Empire, you two. I've been waiting for this moment. 493 to 2368. No ransom worth there. Galatia. Okay. Puts us at 77% on the Empire there. And here we are. Go get him. Get him. All right, y'all need to stop starving to death. Now that I'm, I know that that's fine. We can go ahead and just finish that up. Okay, there's no air there. That's good. Thyatira. Man, that was only worth two percent or something. Defender controls war target. What? What do you mean? That doesn't make any sense. I've captured this, which is a county within the target. The spots of Hellas. The 
the spot tate. So I need to take something from here to get rid of the war target penalty? Alright. If that's what's going to make the difference to you, I'll get to it. Excellent. So we basically win the war as long as we get over and solve that. Fair enough, I guess. This will be done in a second. Thanks for the vassalization. And now they are one with us. Very good. Okay. That brings us to 1043. Not bad. They're gonna make that battle work. Y'all disband. Disband. Okay, how's it going over on this end? I know we're gonna have the recently disembarked penalty, but honestly, I don't even care. Oh, they have five months left anyway. Pedagogy. Hello. Can I open that, please? Colin got one stewardship. Alright. Could definitely be worse. Take that, thank you. Nine sixty five to twenty one forty nine. Sif left the prison. Go ahead and disband that one. King Melet's court, the sport, court now speaks Norse. Bjarmeland, about time. You know Norse is the only true way. Yeah, look at that. Look at that language. Dominance. Love it. Alright, we have the recently disembarked penalty and we're still that, adva that, that advantaged? Oh my god. We, get it, we got him, didn't we? Or is that just the battles won? Yeah, okay. <laughs> 137, that's the war. Ta-da! May your humors rot in your living body. So be it. And your 32 counties. This empire is a, a farce. This thing is nothing. The holy war for the county of Mesopotamia? Okay, good luck with that. Might want to reconsider on that one. Seek indulgences. I realize I didn't disband some of those troops, but I want to get rid of the disband timer by not disbanding until all wars are done, so that'll be able to be... That'll be able to get finished up pretty quick. Oh shoot, that's a limit. That just hit me in my brain. Exactly what that meant. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. That's gonna be a whole thing, isn't it? Okay. Colonia is under siege, sure. Disband this starving group. Can disband this over here. Cause we're about to be done, I think. In Gur. Once this is done, probably. Vaseline it. Okay. Can I grant vassals? I can. Where is this? This to who? To Poland? No. Stop it with the Poland crap. That's not happening. That's nowhere near Poland. Burgundy. Uh, Burgundy. Here you go. Grant Vassal. This guy. He should definitely be a part of Burgundy. There you go. No more vassal limit problems. Uh, any more small counties anywhere in here? The Kingdom of Poland and France. 
capitals are like neighbors. That's weird. No, no small people here. No, no. Everything looks pretty organized-ish in this area, general area. This is a lot of kingdoms and stuff, though. I can see where our problems are coming from. Okay, court artifacts. No. Uh, any more? Okay, here's some small territories. White Roos? That's a new kingdom. Alright, so we'll give the White Roos kingdom to Yaldum of Minsk. Or the county of Babrusk. Let's give it the Minsk. He's super pious. What a dude. Kingdom of the White Roos and two other vassals. There you go. Very nice. Kingdom, kingdom. Here's a Jarldom. Is this a kingdom we could make? No. No, not really. Vladimir, maybe we could, actually. The Kingdom of Vladimir. And we hand that off to... Riazon? Who needs to be converted, by the way. Send a gift. And demand conversion. Send a gift. And demand conversion. Send a gift. Oh, no, never mind. Just demand conversion. There we go. That'll be good. And then we can give him that kingdom. Blessed be Odin. Now that you follow the true way, let me just give you the kingdom of Vladimir. Here you are. And this should be your vassal as well. Obranosh. Yeah. Yeah. Grant Vassal. That guy. Oh, he already is. Okay, never mind. Oh, are both of those? Okay. I'm so confused. Jarldum Njol. He's part of a whole different thing. Okay. Alright, so that's good. God damn, I see where a bunch of our vassals are, actually. <laughs> Yikes. What kingdom is that? Valencia? Why does Valencia not have you, then? I grant you this vassal. Damn, that is a tiny kingdom. The Shire of Tivoli. I miss you, Tivoli. Oh, Jesus. An insane adventurer. <laughs> what am I looking at? Yo, hurry up and hand off the land already. <laughs> oh my god. That's something special right there. That's something special. We've got some interesting characters in our lands. Croatia. Can I make that? Can I usurp that? I could make it. Kingdom of Croatia right there. Alright, any of these worthy of being a king? Aha! We can make it a Ravenheart thing. I know this is going to cause us some stress because we're not supposed to be getting rid of something right now, but... Somebody with no land. No land. No land. But it's a skilled Ravenheart. Girly Ravenheart? Daughter of Countess Inga has lover's box. What a shame. Damn, she even has fecund and everything, dude. This lover's box is awful. Terrible tragedy. Terrible. Um. Wrong dynasty. Bjortric? Also has lover's box. This is real tough. I know Lover's Pox isn't, Pox isn't like the worst thing ever, I just hate it, personally. Blisters all over somebody's face from an STD? Nah, I'll pass. Hero World of Lapland. Does he also have Lover's Pox? He doesn't. 
Now we're talking. Let me grant you a title, sir. That, as well as the Kingdom of Croatia. Which will cost 20, 25 stress, but it will hand over three vassals. Stress level, it is what it is. Let me grant you another vassal. There you go. Okay, this is all Serbia, which we can't quite make yet. Fair enough. Okay, we did a lot of good vassal stuff there. Down to 66 vassals, that's something. That's definitely something. And I know Africa's a little choppy right now, but that's because we're still working on it. Okay, let's go ahead and hit play again, finally. Blessed be Odin. Welcome to the true ways. Blessed be Odin. King Balthier created the cadet branch, Ravenheart Kalatrava. If you say so. Go get him. Oh boy. Go back. Defend our siege. There it is. We got it. Enforce demands. Gorp Basa becomes our vassal and we get the Kingdom of Gur. So be it. Yeah! And that only gave us one additional vassal. That is beautiful how well that worked out. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And is this area still ripe for the taking? I think it is. Because this is only one duchy at the end of the day. So if we buy a claim on this duchy, we can take all of his land. That's what it sounds like it should work like on paper. I keep doing this wrong. Here we go. Buy claim. Because we can only buy duchy claims, but it's a way around getting over this complicated stuff. Yeah, buy that claim. And honesty gives us another stress hit. Fair enough. 11.32, we can start fixing this stuff. And then, yeah. Look at that stuff. This is a four-county kingdom. Okay. And this is a four-county kingdom. Yeah, so these kingdoms are just... Yeah, they just happen to be kingdoms. They're not actually kingdom-sized. So, my armies are raised. That's because we're still dealing with this over here. Your neighbor Krantahim Amati has lost against Farina Nemis. Yamana of Nayen. Interesting. Okay. Sure. I'm going to disband all these groups over here. Africa's starting to look pretty good again. I'm freezing. What the hell was that? Yeah, Africa's starting to look pretty taken over again. Which is good. Cousin killed in siege. That sucks. Nobody likes that. Oh, come on. Catch them. Wipe them out. How are those factions looking? All super weak? And yeah. Plus 20. Wipe them out. And then we can white piece it. There it is. White piece. And there's the renowned perk as well. Hell yeah. Alright. So we were currently working on... What were we working on next? Because we're not going any further on that. This. Vassal limit plus 10. Vassal's less likely to join. All that good stuff. So I guess <laughs> Desirable Match is currently what we're taking. Sure. We have a lot of legacies. Next one's 97.50, and then after that one... Yeah, after that one it's going to cost 5 digits to get new perks. We have 6, 11, 15, 19 perks. Yeah, 19 legacies. Out of the 20, 30, 40, 50. 19 out of 50. So I mean... We could definitely, we're definitely gonna get half of the possible legacies in this game pretty quickly, which is kind of wild. 
Convert faith is done. Good. Means we can put him somewhere else since we don't need to generate piety like I thought we needed to. Uh, oh, there's a atomitism right there. Busted. So what is this Ashari stuff going on? Hello? Interesting. So be it. Very well. Let's declare war on my claims so I can take all of that. Declare war on that duchy, thank you. Declare war on this duchy, thank you. Declare war on this duchy, thank you. Declare war on this duchy. Oh, no cast a spell eye, huh? Alright. Should have checked that I could hit man at arms here. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I really did mess this up, didn't I? I went way too soon. Three months? That's much better than I thought. Much better. Oh, we gotta take this first. A lot of enemy allies jumping in on this one. We're just gonna run over them one by one. Oh my god, they're moving in quick. Quick. That's right, we can holy order this. Buy us some time. Get him. They do need a ruler, a leader, though. Perfect. Queen Inga of Wallachia. A new course beats Norris. The Kingdom of Estonia finally decides that Norris is the right call, huh? Not time on that one. No more Finnick over there. Wagadugu to the Queen of Gur. No, 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 no. I can make the kingdom of Jenny? Really? Really? That's fascinating. Alright, let's make him a king. Grant title, Kingdom of Jene. Bang. All right. Where was I? Oh yeah. Oh yes. Continue onwards. Court jester vacated. Prince Toblood's no longer your court jester. Interesting. Frida's a good antiquarian. Good to know. Seneschal, Anunder, and somebody. We have money to burn. Court Jester. Queen of Poland. Yeah. Her, her lands are a joke. They're all over the place, so let's keep the joke rolling by making her a Jester. They belong in a museum. Oh, no. Her contract must be modified right now. I will allow less levies in return. They've already been changed. Oh my god. Alright, pin her so that um, when her titles pass on, we can modify it instantly. At least she's a good steward. We got lucky with that. She's 24. Not a bad steward at all. Your neighbor has lost against your vassal Jarl uh, Elfmir for the Walaya of Saura. Hey, hey! Well done, Jarl Elfmir. Good job, good job. We're up to almost 1,100 counties now. Wipe them out. Dang. 51 to 1378? That's not messing around. Seek indulgence. That's a lot of seek indulgence constantly happening. Here we go. Alright. It is the year 1131 AD, and our army is finally ready to make their move. How exciting. Nanasio was taken prisoner. Okay. Move there. 
Secret exposed. I never would have thought. Yeah. All that BS is happening again. Ooh, we need. Oh my god. Hero World, you are such an amazing commander, but I need a logistician. Logistician, logistician siege expert would be the dream, but here. Acilia. Logistate my supplies, please. That's a word now. Embrace that. <laughs> Gonna logistate this so hard. Taught a lesson. Grima, you deserve a reward. Thank you so much. Becomes your friend. Awesome. Our daughter's our friend. Cool. We respect our daughter. You can vassalize Farina into Miss of Nyen. Hey! She's a Satru. I don't know why, but I'm down for it. There you go. Kirk is under siege. A shady discussion. I'm passing through the castle gardens for a morning walk when a soft breeze carries the voices of Wiglop and Anunder to my ear. The two courtiers are talking to each other in a secluded spot nearby, frequently glancing around to make sure nobody's listening. But it's hard for me to make out most of their words from distance, it is clear that their discussion relates to Queen Pyra. I must warn her. A lowborn, Javi, and Ravenheart Leda. What is that? I mean, she's a kinslayer, though. She's killed Ravenheart, so... Lose 10 dread. Can you lose 10 dread? Pretty sure we don't have 10 dread. Yeah. I say let it go. She's a kinslayer. If something happens to her, it's on her. Yes, welcome to the Empire. King Toivalon was lost against your vassal Queen Grease in the Lithuanian conquest on the Chiefdom of Sarama. Ooh, we took a chief. We took a little county away from uh, Estonia. Very nice. Nah, yeah, send a letter. We learned Iranian. So we have that now. Sabir. Learn language. Shos Turkic. Maybe this will be the Mongolia. Oh, wait a second. Wait, I just realized how much reach we have because of how far east we are. The fact that we can even interact with these is kind of crazy. I'm just collecting languages, obviously. Secret exposed. Cheaters everywhere. I wish I could say I was shocked, but I'm not. Siege 1. Got a courtier and a bunch of other unimportant people, okay. Once we take this capital, that'll be done. Queen Alette's friendship. You and Queen Alette become friends. I had never expected I would grow as close to Queen Alette as I have done in the past years. Uh, on multiple occasions, she's proven herself to be a reliable and forthright woman with only my best interests at heart. She's generous, humble, and brave. And the stat line don't lie. Kingdom of Galicia, oh my god. Yeah. So rare to find true friends, absolutely. Let's go here. Actually, you know what? Which one of these is the weakest? Link. 676. Yeah, let's let's have uh let's have the holy order go. Are we not at war with them? Yeah, we are. Yeah. Let's have the holy order suffer 700 casualties and start jumping on these guys. There we go, much better. 270. While we work our way across. Neighbor Ban lost against something something for the county of Satina. And now it's called uh, Spalathos. Okay. Croatia took it from that little area. Okay. We got windmills! Let's go! Windmills! We now can make high medieval era economic buildings. I'm hype about that. Urbanization's already happening on its own. Hmm. High partition is nice. But not good enough. Castle Bailey's, Trebuchet. Yeah, I think Castle Bailey's is next. So 11 years on Castle Bailey's, 22 on urbanization. But let's start getting the windmills going. Yes, a large mine, absolutely. 
granaries. Granaries, sorry. Granaries. Large mines. Hunter stables. Expanded docks. Alright. Freeholds. A Zwinger. When an enemy army manages to break through the outer walls, they will unwittingly be funneled into the Zwinger, also known as the Killing Fields. Devilishly clever. Yeah, that sounds really good in war. Not, I don't know about an economic building, but very good. Alright, Ravenholm. I know Ravenholm needs some building. Yeah. Zwinger. Bromsa? No, okay. Wait, Bromsa needs to be a city center. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No longer content with just occupying its original area, the city now subsumes nearby farmland into its prosperous center. The city is fast and full of wealth. Alright, we're making this happen out here. Absolutely. Get the windmills trucking. So that is four, eight, ten, eleven. So there's one unaccounted for somewhere, that's fine. Oh, let's go battle that. How many men at arms are we talking right here? A decent little chunk, actually. Huh. We have great champions? No, we don't. Colin increases intrigue by one. Okay, I'm not sure how much that's going to help us, but okay. Pyra's stewardship. That's cool. Thyra. This diplomacy. Safira. Go Marshall. I kind of wish Pyra had gone learning here. But oh well. Not the end of the world. Maybe Gunhilder can be our learning dread queen. <laughs> Figure in position's garb appears has a, appears has arrived. Okay. With a case of tools, but my stomach churns as a hammer and pick are revealed amongst them. My lord, I am a proficient trepaner. As an occultist, your own powers may be formid formidable, but there is still a barrier holding them back. Your majesty could conquer the world over the spirits if the air could enter your skull. Yeah, no shot whatsoever. Damages your body, damages your mental faculties, does nothing, you survive the trepanning unscathed. I shall decline, but perhaps my physician could learn from you. My affliction. Affliction. What are you talking about? Huh? Bro, what are you even talking about? Pseudomedicine for 10 years. Okay. Sure. Why not? <laughs> I don't know what affliction they're talking about, but sure. Go get them. We got to start chasing them down because we're not going to catch them right here. Recently disembarked, will be gone by the time we catch up to him. Barbara died in the dungeons. Hate to see it. Diplomacy lifestyle perk. All right, there's writing history and diplomacy's done. We have all the really good learning skills. 50% development is good no matter what, though. You know, maybe we do want to live longer once we get Holy Kingdom Wars all the time. Hmm. Maybe, maybe. Maybe we do want to go whole of body here. I mean, we, we want Know Thyself anyway. Know Thyself is a for sure want. Uh, your neighbor, Patriarch Eugenios, has won against Duke Aristarchos for the Chiefdom of Pakatiana. Okay. Good job, everybody. Byzantine Empire is at 32. Antanalokion and Anatolikon. Anatol... What? 
I've never been so stumped by a name in my life. Anata Lacan. I'm gonna say Anata Lacan. I think that's correct-ish. And I'll have to take correct-ish, considering what I'm working with. Ooh, we can vassalize Countess Egwin of Sokoto. Where is that? Excellent. Welcome to the Empire. The greatest empire there is. And that ever will be. Because the Mongolian Empire is making the mistake of trying to get started too late. I'm just saying. It's 1131 and I'm still not seeing you out here. Overwhelmed by stress, gracious offer of vassalization. My sister duels this died of natural causes. I need stress relief. Write thoughts down. I dip my pen once more. Occupied writing for one year. It is what it is. Mission that epic, yeah. Stop the villain behind trying to kill my kinswoman Vex. Yeah, definitely. Look at this absolute beast of a woman. <laughs> I love it. Family epic. Marcus the accomplished storyteller. Yes. Seek indulgences. I don't need the Duchy of Kebby. Mm, man, this kind of sucks. I'm not going to lie. We'll just go for that again. Family epic perspective. Family history, so give me that renown. Capture right here should end this war. Show Queen Pyra in with the generous, rich gifts. I accept your generous gifts, Queen Pyra. Thank you. Now we get 100 renown for that because we were both Ravenheart. So we both got the 50. It's big. Okay, we should have just ended the war there. But oh well. Alright, on to the next capture. Dang, they really hurt themselves with that one. Have ain't mush an unlanded dude willing to pay 150 huh? That's weird. The Conant of Permia speaks Norris. Hey! It expands once more. <laughs> I've really been enjoying watching how far our language is traveling. It's really making it. Alright, that's one war down. Thank you. Much appreciated. You... Tell me you're willing to convert to Asatru, and I will give you all the land you could possibly desire. And by that, I mean this county right here. Blessed be Odin. It's all yours. Enjoy. Wait. After I get more, because ambition doesn't want me to. Sensual proposal. Whenever I go, my beneficiary Frida is sure to follow. Hmm, you don't say... How sweet, but no. I'm married. I'm a married man. With my soulmate, no less. Under siege? Okay. Count Faluku goes from Seninke to Wolof. Sure. We'll say that's a thing. My daughter Grima is giving birth to a daughter. A granddaughter. And she's a unit! That's so unfitting that it's fitting. You know what I mean? That's so unfitting that it's fitting. I love that name right now. Alright, you're not going to be good at sieging anyway. Let's just go over here and stop them again. Down in faith. Uh, there's this a telling of a wonderful moral, he claims. The Ravenheart dynasty has always seen greatness when advised by clerics in dark times when it's failed to heed that advice. I hope it is a lesson you will heed equally well. Um, Chris's piety and the same faith tax. Well, that's the other way around. David, Dynasty, we have always led the way for the elders. 150 prestige, 300 learning lifestyle experience, and 50 renown? Oh my god. We both know family comes first in all things. Ordgar is of the same dynasty as me, so we get 300 learning and 75 renown. Yeah, that's better. Because we don't need that prestige. That's good. We both know family comes first in all things. And that gives us the perk. Awesome. We're on the way.
Wiglaf is no longer our cupbearer. We keep losing people. Stop leaving me. Sverker? You're in good health. I got so many prisoners to release before next time. <laughs> Whoops! Okay. This one is. Theodora has died. And Amadeus has died. Yikes, yikes, yikes. It's tough out here. Precedence. Uh, it seems that the County of Bree was never intended to be permanently in the hands of House de Mortemart. But reading the latest part of your family epic, it has discovered something very interesting. I can make a reasonable claim against Count Gosschalk. He's my vassal, though. We can let it pass. Crease is futile to- he'll want to formalize the grants. Yeah. Nice. Increase those taxes. Uh, alright. And now is probably a good time to stop the episode, if I'm being honest. Damn. Um, because I, I do have a lot to do. Just IRL for my job and stuff. Sorry. Um. I gotta sneeze. It's not coming, but it's coming. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it'll happen. Alright, but yeah, we're making good progress. We're gonna take a, a few more counties and a few more duchies and see what happens next time from there. Thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you've really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Either way, thank you so much for joining myself, Filkir Drake, Empress Hafrider, Colin, and the rest of the Ravenheart Dynasty on this grand campaign. And I will see all of you next time.